boys and girls, it's Queen Bee from Honey Bee Toys, and today we are making color changing Shopkins. So I already made these three Shopkins. This is Cindy Bun, Ice Cream Dream, and Bailey Base Baseball. Oh, I forgot her name. Baseball glove. Bailey. Bailey baseball glove. Bailey baseball glove. Sorry about that. Bailey baseball garbs. So it's season four, five, season four, and then I think this one's season three. So I'm gonna show you how they change colors, and I'm gonna show you some cool. So I'm just. This is just an ice cube right here and stick it in this water to make it nice and cold and i'm going to take bailey baseball glove and i wonder if i could do it so you can see the changing color do you see that oh she's floating she's it's like she has red blood <laughs> there so she changed color to a dark red and this is ice cream dream and we're gonna stick her into how about you just stick all of them in and then you see how the top of her became she was blue and now she became a dark red and then we have Cindy Bun here. So Cindy Bun, we're gonna stick her in. And look at that. She became pink, I know. We can stick all of them in. And so we can stick all of them in. And if you wanna change them back, you can just apply some heat from your hands and then they Purple. change back, so you see. We're gonna take this and then make her dark. This is just an ice cube. And then I put the heat from my hand, so she's color changing. I actually wanna show you, this is my nail. And I am going to change the color of my nail polish using the same ice cube. And then if I use the heat from my hand, I can change it back. And if I stick my finger in there, in the water, it's pink again. So let's get started on how to make this cool color changing. Oh, you want, you want, it, we want So we're going to use these three Shopkins and make them all color changing. Can I do it? Okay. So I have this gel nail polish from Be Bellin that I bought off eBay, and they're really cheap. They're only $1.50, but they are gel, so that you have to use a UV light. <coughs> if you don't have gel polish, um, I think they make just regular polish without a UV light. So for Jilly Jam, we're gonna take this. It's pink, supposed it's to be the same one. Pink and yellow. Like this. And then we're just gonna color the top of Jilly Jam. Is that the bottom? No, we're just gonna do the top. Cause it'll look pretty with the top. Just the top, like this. She's gonna paint it all the way around. What if you get on your hands? Well, you have to be very careful not to get any on your hands. Okay, and then we're gonna leave it over there. And then what color should we paint April apricot? This one. This one. So this one changes from a dark to a light peach apricot color, which is perfect for April apricot. And where should we paint? What should we paint on April apricot? The leaf. Just the leaf? Should we just do the no, leaf? No, no. How about just all this part? This part? How about just the, you wanna do the whole thing? And do the whole thing, Alexis. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're gonna paint all of April apricot. We have then. to be careful because the eyes. I know we want to get all around the eyes, so we want to be very careful. And, and we don't the wanna, mouth. We don't want to do the leaf either. April apricot starting to look like a uh, cherry because she's so she's so red now. She looks like a cherry. She looks like a cherry, but she's an apricot. She's so cute. Okay, do we get all of April apricot? Yeah. Yeah, okay, so let's set her down. And what's the last one we're gonna paint? I know why we can't paint this it bubbles. on the bottom. Can you put that wait, wait. in the oh, water we, first? We, oh, we didn't paint her yet. We can't put her in the water yet. So I can't remember what her name is. I'm gonna call her Bubbles. It's Tub. It's Tub? <laughs> Not. We don't know what her name is. I think this yellow color would be prettier. So this one, it looks like it's gonna be red, but once it dries, it actually dries this light yellow. So I'm gonna paint all the like bubbles. Pink. Oh, bless you. What are you doing? Okay, so now all of them are painted and then we're gonna have to set it with our LED lamp. So I'm just gonna put them into this LED lamp and set it for around one minute. That's and the setting. And we can't look at the light. And we don't wanna look at the light. So I'm just gonna turn it on. And then I'll be, okay, so they're all set from the gel lamp, and then I just wipe them with a little alcohol, and now they are ready to be color changing. And you could also use a little clear coat if you wanted to, but I'm just gonna leave it like this. And they are all ready for some color changing, so I'm gonna take my hey. ice cube with water. Look at all these I'm little Shopkins that. in there that are taking their little Shopkins baths. They're very, Ew. they're very cold. Like even my hands are cold, and you can see. And my hands. Let's put half of her in there. Look at that. So half of her is pink and the other half is blue. So let's stick yeah, April it. apricot inside and she is getting all red. <gasps> April apricot, we can call her a little cherry tomato if we wanted to because she's so red now. And then Cindy bun, Cindy bun, the top of her bun is so much more red. 
And if we wanted to cool it off, we're gonna just use our body heat and then change the color back. Oh, why does it not really look like red? Can I change use the color back. See, so it? using our it's body heat, we change the color back. Why well, what's not changing? Because it's this finger. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment. And stay tuned for my Shopkins giveaway. Thank you, and bye now.